Hi guys, welcome to Xperia Tips. I'm Dom and this is the second video looking at security on your Xperia device. Last time we looked at Sony's fingerprint scanner on the Xperia XZ and X Compact as well as their My Xperia service. If you missed it, just make sure you watch it so you can secure your device properly. I don't know, like maybe subscribe or something so you don't miss any future episodes. But today we're going to be looking at screen pinning, hiding photos and also smart lock. Screen pinning is a fantastic feature, especially if you've got kids who like to play games on your handset or perhaps uh, someone that you don't necessarily know too well needs to use your phone in an emergency. To activate it, just pop into the security settings, scroll down to the bottom and you'll see it there. Once you've activated it, you can open up the app or screen that you want pinned Tap on your recent apps button, swipe up and you'll see the pin icon. Once you tap that, you know that whoever uses your phone now can't go into any other app without your fingerprint or pin number. This means that they can't go into your album app and have a look at any personal pictures that you might have. But what if they do? Well, worry not. In Sony's album app, if you want to hide certain pictures, just select them, press the three dots in the corner and select hide then they'll seemingly disappear from your gallery and you'll only be able to access them from your hidden folder in the sidebar, which can also be hidden by going into the album settings, navigation menu, and then unchecking the hidden folder. They don't know you've got hidden photos if they can't see the hidden folder. Anyway, smart lock. This thing is awesome if there are certain places or things that you trust. Smartwatch, you shall never betray me. All you need to do is go into settings, security, and select smart lock. You'll have to confirm your PIN code before you can access it, but once you're in, you'll have a load of options available to you, and one of them is trusted devices. And this is where you can set up Bluetooth devices you use, such as your smartwatch, as a trusted device. Hit my boy. Whenever my smartwatch is in range, I won't need my fingerprint or my PIN code. You can also set up your home as a trusted place if you know that there's no risk of your phone being tampered with there. You can also set up a trusted face with facial recognition and also a trusted voice so you can use the OK Google command from any screen. OK Google. Search for Xperia Tips on YouTube. There we go, you should totally subscribe, look. So, there you have it. Even more ways to secure your Sony device and the contents within it. Don't forget to like, follow and subscribe, and I'll see you next time for some more Xperia Tips. Mm -hmm.